Hi guys, welcome and uh, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to do a complete IFR flight from Fullerton KFUL to bracket KPOC. I'm going to try to do this briefing very quick so we can get into the cockpit and show you the flight. Let's look at the chart. The chart is a little bit complicated, so let me simplify it just so we can see it better. As with every IFR flight, there's a departure procedure, in and out procedure, and approach procedure. What we're cleared for on this flight was a standard Fullerton 24 departure, which is on takeoff, turn heading 120. Radar vectors to Seal Beach VOR. That means the ATC is going to guide us there. Uh, the en route procedure was going to be from Seal Beach, Victor 8, Poxku, Victor 363, Prado, and then at Prado we will do the approach. We will start the approach. But because this Los Angeles is very busy, the flight is so short, the ATC will just vector us. We'll do the departure procedure on takeoff. We're going to turn to a heading of 120. We're going to fly like that for a couple minutes, and then the ATC is going to start vectoring us to a heading of 100 then really quickly to a heading of 030 and 040. Next thing we're going to do is they're going to send us on a heading of 360, which is actually direct to Pomona VOR. And the reason the ATC kind of vectored us here a little bit to the north is because Victor 8 comes very close to the approaches that go into John Wayne. And as I mentioned before, this was a busy day. There was a lot of airplanes going into John Wayne. You're going to hear that. I'm going to ask the ATC to give me the ILS approach, but because it was busy, the ATC said unable, so we just did the VOR approach. As far as the VOR approach, we're being vectored onto it. We don't have to do any procedure turns. So the ATC told us to go heading of 030, intercept the final approach course, which is 344. We start off at 3000 feet. We intercept the final approach course just inside Prado, which means once we intercept it, we can go down to 2500. It's a basic step down descent, 2,500 until Goldie. At point Goldie, then we can go down to 1,800, which is the minimums for this approach. Anyway, guys, that's it as far as the briefing goes. You can brief the approach plate a little better if you want to. I just went over the quick points of it. So let's get ourselves inside this airplane and let's go do this flight. Sky in 07 Romeo, runway 24, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, runway 24, 07 Romeo. That's 647, runway 24, clear to land. Runway 24, clear to land, 647. This always looks shorter than it is. Really. It's that fence at the end.
It's a little bumpy. Number 48340, level 2000. Number 48340, so Southbound Coach. Train to Turn right, heading 250, vector traffic, 2 o'clock, 2 miles, eastbound, Southbound 2000. Right now, we enter the clouds, just like that. All of a sudden, we're inside them. When I get a frequency transfer now, I go to the next ADC. That ADC is going to be very busy. I want you guys to pay attention how good that guy is and how busy the skies of Los Angeles are. Also, when we get transferred, the ATC is going to give us a new vector, which is a vector of 100. Tesla 0 to Romeo, climbing to 3,000, kind of approach to 1 to 1.3. Out of uh, 1,900, 3,000, and 1 to 1.307 on. 26 AC, 26 AL2, 5 0 2. So, if I approach going 2307 on this, will you out of 2,200 for 3,000? 2307 running, Roger, maintain 3,000 and flight heading 100. Roger, heading 100, and out of 2,200, 3,000. Frontier 261, turn right 170, 3000, established on final clear to ILS, 20 right. 170, uh, 3000 till established, cleared for the ILS, 20 right, Frontier 261. Frontier 3238, the ZFR traffic at your 10 o'clock, 2 and a half miles, southbound on 4000. And we're looking for that TKS target, southbound 3238, he's inside. 24 o'clock shot, turn left heading 170. Left 170, 24 o'clock. And see where Fox Red Chevy gets your 10 o'clock, 2 miles north on 5,000, but he's descending to southwest 737. We got the beauty in sight. 2 for Fox. Up to 3238, descend and maintain 3,000. 3,000, southwest 3238. November, one out the tank, descend and maintain 3,000. 2 and maintain 3,000, one out the tank. Up to 3238, turn right 090. 090, southwest 3238. So, okay, I'm going to get 526 leveling, 6,600-260. Except 526, okay, you're getting responsible with Roger, they just keep your head there. Okay. Southwest 3238, turn right 090. 090, Southwest 3238. Frontier 261, tower 26, take it in. 26, 8, Frontier 261, have a great rest of your day. All right, 245 shot, turn left heading 040. 040, 245. 07, Romeo, turn left heading 030. Left 030, 07, Romeo. He's taking care of business, isn't he? Yeah, really. Flex, yeah, 526, fighting 250. Two thousand zero, Tango, maintain three thousand. Come back to first one two five three five. Maintain two thousand and one two five three five. One off Tango. Delta three two thirty eight. Amount to take turn right one eight zero three thousand. Delta final three dial up two zero eight. One eighty and three. Clear the out of two zero right. Delta thirty two thirty eight. Delta Romeo, maintain zero four zero. Zero four zero for zero seven off. Right to five twenty six. We're going to maintain four thousand. Four thousand. Watch it five twenty six. 245 shot, turn up heading 020, you're going to get safe about one mile, just so you know. 020, uh, 245, thanks. Oh, that's the end of the clouds. Yeah. Right there. Water shot, Captain, 252, 252, with that, Delta Chino. 23 Papa, pick out the third runner. Thank you, Bob. Romeo, turn left 360, direct Pomona, VOR. Left 360, direct Pomona, 079. Turn 245 shot, turn right 090. Right 090, 245. Southwest 3238, tower 268, have a good one. Good day, good job. Thanks. Just so you guys saw, the ATC uh, gave us a 030 and then 040 right after it. And now we're uh, 360 direct from on a VOR, and you can see I'm uh, fine-tuning the VOR, and yep, it's uh, 360, and the VOR center. We're flying direct to them on a VOR. We're not going to go that far, I hope. Gives me something to do. Oh, okay. <laughs> I know the feeling. 007 Romeo, traffic at your 2 to 3 o'clock, 2 miles east on the steps of VFR 4000. 07 Romeo, look for that traffic. 
We can begin our descent down to 2,500 until Goldie. Good afternoon, everybody. 
Okay, so now we have the ATIS. We're 2,500 feet now. We just reached Goldie. We're going to begin our descent to the minimums, 1,800. As you can tell, it's pretty bumpy, especially on a hot day, windy day like today. That's what happens. I've been having to adjust my heading. Um, I'm not chasing the needle. I'm actually flying headings and trying to keep the VOR needle centered. Again, you guys can see outside. I have the hood on, and I can't see anything except those instruments. Getting down to 1,800 feet minimums. There it is, 18. There we're here. There's the VOR. Right in front of me. Those minimums. I took my hood off and I saw the VOR. Now it's kind of hard to see the VOR in this video. If you look ahead, there's a little road just above the the nose. And just to the right of that road, on the top of a hill, is like a white spot, or a lighter spot. And that's the VOR, that's where we're flying to. As we get closer, you'll get to see it better and actually get a good look at it. So pretty much now, this is all visual, this is a circle to land. This is the fun part of instrument flying. And that was the VOR we just passed. sort of on a downwind now, but uh, because it's a circle to land, I'm going to do a short approach. So I'm just going to start my turn onto the final right now. It's going to be one continuous, nice, gentle turn right onto the final, right onto the runway. And I love doing these just because they're fun and it's a little bit challenging. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video. Thanks for sticking with it. I appreciate it. And I'll see you guys soon. Land 250 at 8.
Zero seven Romeo, contact ground. Have a good day. Zero seven Romeo, to ground. Good day.